Okay, this time I'm going to work with some text using the GIMP. I zoomed out here. I grabbed my zoom tool. Zoom in, zoom out. Control is the toggle, so with your control key down you can zoom out. If you let go, you zoom in, right? And we'll work with some text, so I'll hit the text tool here. And um, you can set, when you hit the text tool, you set the font here, right? You can scroll through your fonts right here, right? Uh, impact, condensed, and then the size here. I'll set it for size 50 here, right? Color, right? Set your color, right? And then just click and type. The You get like a little text editor window for typing your text. That's kind of different. The GIMP, right? And notice that the font is kind of small here. So let's up the size. See if we can get it to be. There we go. 499 um, pixels. PX, right? Hinting. That's cool. Got some stuff here. Right. All right. That's fine. Close. And there's my um, text, right? Now I can um, select that layer. And with my move tool, I can drag this text and move it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um, let's talk about um, something else with the GIMP. This is kind of something that frustrates a lot of people. I'm going to turn this eyeball off, go to the background layer, and I'm going to copy something. I'm going to get my selection tool here, and I'm going to um, make a box selection here, right? Okay, so I've got a selection right here, and then I'm going to do Control C to copy, right? and a control V to paste. So now notice it says floating selection layer here, right? And in um, Photoshop this would be a new layer and you'd have a copy of this right there and, and you'd be all good to go. But in the GIMP you don't. Um, you have to actually paste this down for this to um, to work. So what you do, what you need to do now is create uh, this, click this button right here uh, create new layer and in other words this floating selection uh, pasted layer is not a layer yet until you click this button right here new layer click that and now it's a pasted layer see I'll turn the eyeball off and now you'll see it there see now it's a pasted layer and it's good to go so you have to click that new layer um, button um, or right click the layer and hit new layer right I'll do that again right click the layer and hit new layer um, for it to actually take. Okay, and I'll turn this back on again. Let's see if we can get some type of effect on there. Um, layers, let's see here. Colors, tools. Oh, I forget. Filters. Um, let's see here. Artistic. I hit uh, cubism. All right, there we go. Put a little filter on there. Uh, tile size, saturation, and click OK. And that didn't do anything, but oh well, we tried. Um, so anyway, now I can move this layer, and you can see that, in fact, it was pasted, and um, we're good to go. Now the filter did work. It's just hard to see that filter showing up there. It doesn't wasn't a good choice, right? Okay. Anyway, it's a short video on uh, how to uh, paste a selection using the GIMP and how to work with text. You can also change the layer ordering the same as you would with um, Photoshop. And whoops, move the background layer there. And I'll come back with some more GIMP um, little tutorials uh, soon.